Cancer has been around almost as long as life has been around. Every day, a certain amount of cells in your body become cancerous. But then, your immune system swoops in to save the day by taking cancer out back. It's when our immune system fails to do its job that cancer comes in for a hostile takeover. With all these immune system strengthening drugs out there, you may wonder why cancer is more prevalent today than in the past. Part of it can be attributed to our lifespans. Because we are living longer, more of us reach ages where cancer is more prevalent, which is from your 50s onward. Other factors include race and socioeconomic status. More African Americans get cancer in the US than any other studied race. This is partially because they are more likely to live and work near chemical factories that are literally kicking out carcinogens to the people that live nearby. This is the moral equivalent of a legal drug cartel. This ain't coincidental either. Just think about which class of people tells factories where they're allowed to set up shop. There's a whole movement established to stop this. Some believe that the cancer industry is too prosperous to invent real cures, as temporary treatments make for a more profitable business model. Is there some truth to this? Well, the global market for cancer drugs has hit 100 billion in annual sales and could reach 147 billion in 2018. More on this in future videos. One out of every three people living in the United States are expected to get cancer in their lifetimes. Wonder how you can avoid it? Obvious ways are avoiding tobacco use, eating unprocessed foods, which lower class families often can't afford, and being physically active. So get out of that desk chair. You know it's bad for you. Yeah. You. Less obvious ways are using sunscreen and self-exams. Millions report positive effects from natural cures and treatments, but many of these claims are not yet backed by research. More on this in future videos. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. As for next week, well, stick around and find out. Fascinate.